listen here. You better watch every every show because they're getting better and better. And if you don't subscribe, I'm going to find you and kick you right off the fucking team. Good morning. This is going to be the start of vlog number seven. I have a tour to give for the next four days in a row. Just getting ready to head down to Copper Mountain as we speak to meet them for day one. Stay tuned. Welcome to Copper Mountain. Thanks, bro. All right, so we're up here on the Timberline lift here at Copper Mountain. Just getting after it on the boards. You, woo! -hoo! So we just finished day one with the Votor. Kimmy off after their vacation and then I gotta get back to doing the tour so stay tuned. And the next thing you know the rattles, there's three of them come up around them and they're just rattling the side and his face is lit up and his gnarly mug is going off with black straight hair and the room is just fucking upheaval and by this time I'm sitting down going holy shit. See the homie. What's up Lucifer? Look at those eyeballs. Out here at Copper, day three with the boys. Yeah. Spectrum Shred Tours, getting after it. Gonna get in trouble. If you're not first, you're last. This is a soul for your production. day three on SST on mountain tour with the Vo party and we have hit almost every lift on the mountain after we hit this lift there's one on the back called three bears that we haven't made it to yet but we're gonna see if that falls into tomorrow 
Other than that, we've had a great time. The Vaux party took very good care of me. That's him in the green sweater behind. And then one more chair, two more chairs back is his buddy James. Other than that, I'm gonna show you what it looks like here on the lumberjack chair. Beautiful day, taking our last run on our third day and uh, getting ready to start making plans for tomorrow. Tonight we will be hitting Pho restaurant to eat a bowl of Pho and we will also be hitting a hot tub in Beaver Creek so stay tuned for more action. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Peacock <laughs> in Colorado. <laughs> So I just left Copper after a fun half day of riding and I'm heading to Beaver Creek so I can jump in the hot tub with my tour this week. They invited me over here for dinner and a hot tub. So here we go. Have you ever seen that before? Wild. I have not. <laughs> Getting ready to hop in this hot tub right here. Pulled up to one of me and Jade's favorite restaurants and it's Faux Bay. We're here in Vail this time though. I've never been to this location, so stay tuned for the best pho around. Bowl of that fire. You don't put any flavor in your sauce, huh? In no. Your yeah, no, I, I like it just how it comes. Johnny's loading up over here. All veggies. Yeah. What, the hoisin sauce or that hot sauce? Sriracha? It's the hoisin, I, like, I dip my meat in my hoisin sauce. Yeah. Instead, you kinda, instead of putting my broth, because I enjoy the broth. But I do the I, I'm surprised you don't dip your meat in that sauce right there, the peanut sauce. I've got a combination rice plate over here. Who's ready to get smoked in a game of pool? Not me. You guys no. play or no? I play a little bit. I've played a few years, but... Uh... I've played, I've played. We're here in uh, Vail Village, going through the parking garage, getting ready to hit a basement bar called The George, also known as the Jorge. Jorge! How's this bathroom right here? Went to use the mirror? Can't see nothing. The Ski Trooper and Johnny Vo, the Snowboard Trooper. known Johnny for a couple of years now and uh, I've always helped him out where I can but this trip we kind of became closer friends and he's invited us to come hang with him in Destin Fort Walton Beach Florida so at some point maybe closer to May you may end up seeing a vlog where we are cruising on the boat or at Crab Island with the beautiful water and sandbars and so on so be ready to see some uh, beautiful Florida sometime around May Benny B from SST pulling up on the scene ready for anything. Shadow Donkey checking in on the gondola American Eagle. We've got Stinky Pinky and Rubber Ducky. And we're here on the fourth day of our tour. Just getting ready to finish strong, so stay tuned. Oxy. 
just want to thank everybody out there for watching, for liking, for commenting, and subscribing to my channel. I'm just going to keep bringing more content and hope to expand my subscriptions. So we're about to drop on the very last run of the Vo tour. So we're getting ready to say goodbye to these guys. So I'm gonna follow cam them a little bit on the way down. Look at how buried up into this little corner this big dope boy is. Every time I call him out and put him on camera, he's like, what man, I'm up. I'm up. Today's Saturday and we pretty much took the day off everything. All I did was some laundry and kind of cleaned up around the house after a four day tour of not having much time and I am currently just running some errands down in Frisco. The sunset looked pretty beautiful so I figured I would show you guys kind of what that's looking like. My wife had gotten me a drone for Christmas and I had never opened it. So today I'm gonna open that box up and put it together and uh, try to get some drone footage on some of our upcoming vlogs. So hopefully I can bring you guys some more content that you haven't seen yet and uh, keep the ball rolling. For now I'm just hanging out with my boy Kodak and we're relaxing. Here we go. Okay, so we just threw the batteries in the remote controller. We've got the blades. We've got the legs for landing gear and we've got the camera attached. Look at me when I'm talking to you. Hey, Kodak, I said look at me when I'm talking to you. Just okay, buddy, I'm just kidding, I'm just kidding, boy. This thing's kind of scary. Oh my God. Alright, so I'm going to be honest, I had no idea what I was doing just now and uh, it definitely did launch and it did stay hovering and I flew it about 100 yards around the block but I think it started beeping and uh, powered down because it landed randomly so I think I need to charge it up. Anyways, I'll learn what I'm doing and I'll get better at it and I'll add some footage to the vlog soon so stay tuned. So I figured how to get the cell phone onto the remote control. And I also added these protectors for the blades. So we're coming a little ways. Running down to Summit County to run a few errands and it started snowing, which we really need. So I'm stoked right now and I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. I just had a good friend of mine gift me this iPad 11 Pro and I am going to basically use it for my business. I'm gonna put some QuickBooks point of sale on here and start uh, being able to log everything properly in order to uh, pay taxes and keep everything proper at the end of the year. It's my good friend Crash. I seen a dumpster across the way. We're gonna handle something. See ya! Crash oh. says he's a professional. I've done all your work on your truck. 
I got a professional in my pocket, ladies and gentlemen. Are you ready? I'm ready. Supercharger on her car. On her uh, Tacoma. <laughs> Good morning, today is a good day. We received our certificate for our new LLC and we are going in to get our business license application turned in and then later on start our new bank account for our new business. Moving right along. All right, going to get this mop chopped off my head, so stay tuned. All right, how do we look? Hope you guys like it. Feeling like I'm 18 or 19 again. If you guys are in the Frisco area, stop in over here at the Gentleman's Barber Shop and uh, see Joe, he crushes it. I always feel like I look a lot younger when I cut my hair, but that's all right. I'm 33 years old, going on 23, so keep it moving. Get that, Phil. Got it all on GoPro. <laughs> 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 